Hello? Your connection is not good. You want to call me? What, what I can do with you? Hello? Hello? Yes. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. Are you a Muslim, my friend? I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. Are you a Muslim? Is my... Sorry? Yes, I'm a Muslim. Okay, what does that mean? Sorry? What does that mean to be a Muslim? To be in complete submission to God. Where, where do you get this definition from? From the word Islam? No, no. Where, where do you get the word Islam means submission to God? Can you show me? Sorry, I don't understand. I, well, I didn't call I, for this person. I asked I you. No, no, no problem, you see. But in order to have a conversation, you say to me, I'm a Muslim, but obviously you do not know what Muslim mean. I never heard anywhere it says that to be a Muslim, it is to be submitted to God. Where do you get this yes, from? Yes, because because what is what does Muslim mean? Uh, uh, Islam means surrender. Islam to Islam. Islam no, means to surrender. What does Muslim mean? Islam means surrender. Yes. Okay. And Muslim means surrender. Yeah, surrender. Muslim surrender is not submit. This is different. Surrender is in a war time where somebody forces you to be uh, to be surrender to him, not like submission. Submission is something you do willingly. What does what does Islam has and Muslim have in common? What they have? They kiss a black stone. They kiss a black stone. They hate the Christian and the Jews and the Hindus and the atheists. They want to kill them all. Why? I don't know why you're. Jumping from one topic to the next. You are the one who said to me what the Muslims have in common. I said to you, all of them they have in common hatred, violence. No, no I didn't say that. Kidding. You, you, said, you said to me, okay, repeat again. So, sorry, maybe I, I got no, you no, wrong. I, yeah, no, I, I said I said that. What does the word Islam and the word Muslim have in common? That you surrender to the cult of Islam, to the sword of Muhammad. Muhammad, he said, I've been ordered to kill all mankind unless they come and they say I am a prophet. No, no, you're taking it the wrong way. Okay, you tell me. Here we go. Here we go. The hate in front yeah. of you on the screen. Uh, then Jesus said that I have come to restore peace, but I have come with a sword. What no, pro no problem. Read the verses after that, and you will see that Jesus is talking about that we will be killed, not he will kill us. Not not, okay. not we will kill you. That that yeah. Jesus, he said, time will come, and people will be thinking by killing you, doing a favor to God. It's not us we will kill. Did Jesus kill anyone? Okay. By the way, um, by the way, by the way, by the way, did Jesus kill anyone? By they the have way, any followers? Did Jesus kill anyone? By the way. He couldn't. Okay. No, he could, he could not. Why? Killing is very easy. Oh. Well, when 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 they when they came to arrest him, Peter, he took his sword and he cut the ear of the of, of the soldier. Jesus, he told him, the one who lived by the sword, die by the sword, and he put the ear of the uh, of the soldier back to his his head. So Jesus, not was, only not only he stopped his man from killing somebody, even he healed that man who is coming to hurt Jesus and arrest him and take him to be crucified. So now I ask you. Did your prophet but says? Did your pro did your prophet says? I've been commanded to kill all mankind until they convert to Islam. Yes or no? Okay. Okay. I don't even know what the topic is anymore because you're you're jumping so much. Which okay. was the topic again? No problem. We go back to the topic. The topic is prophet was a, 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 with a false prophecy. Do you have any prophecy, Muhammad? He said is true. Yeah. The the prophecy of the um, of his uncle, About which what? is mentioned in Quran. Hmm. I like yeah. this one. Okay. Yeah. What is the prophecy this one is talking about? The prophecy means that he will die as a copper. Really? It says that? Yeah, that's what it means. Okay, let us go and see. If you remember, do you know, you remember somebody, his name is uh, Abu Sufyan? Yes. Okay. Isn't it the Quran says a verse about him too, that he is going to be punished by Allah and he is a kafir? No, it doesn't say about him. By okay. the way, the earlier don't the earlier don't change topic. Day, okay, no, no, I'm not, no, no, no. you okay. just mentioned this before just now. You mentioned it just now. Mm. That's why I heard this and I called. Okay, you mentioned a verse of, of a man who be, who actually um who actually was a Muslim, right? Mm. And then he later mm. left Islam, mm. right? And then he went back to Makkah and he said that such and such happened, and then I made a verse and then he accepted it, right? Mm. Something like that. Mm. Actually, this man converted to Islam. Mm. During the time of Medina, because we have an authentic source mm. where it clearly says that he he became a Muslim after the Battle of Badr, mm. and 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 we know for a fact that this ayah came mm. at the time in Makkah, mm. so it cannot apply to him. No, it can apply for him, my friend, because simply oh. this guy he left Islam and he ran away. Do you think he will stay with Muhammad after he convert after he left Islam? You are naive, my friend. Secondly. When you say it does not apply for him, then you have to to, to explain the, the interpretation. When I show interpretation, this is your interpretation by your scholars. So don't say to me, it does not apply to him. Who are you to say so? You are there? But 
but but the, thing, but the only problem with your interpretation is that mm -hmm. you this, can take a first of all this is not my interpretation this is your scholar's okay, interpretation am, yes I'm, I'm explaining it all right the scholar can really not know about it so how like, how you know how you a scholar yeah. making a mistake because he could have because because a lot of hadiths we have our sciences improved we can now tell what hadith was came in what time and it wasn't available to everyone that's why okay so so, so uh, okay so you know you know how and the scholars do not know how you because you are smart you do not know and now let me ask you as oh, long as the story okay but the story is documented that this guy he said to to, to the prophet he do not know what he's talking about he say as you hakim i say etc he accept what i say so if he is a prophet i am a prophet too and he left islam this is a documented story by muslim scholars and this is a true story why yes, this guy why yes, this guy but the, but the, yeah, okay. why this because, guy he said muhammad is a false prophet because just like you say it doesn't make him a false prophet mm -hmm. you know okay just like you saying he's a false prophet doesn't make him a false okay prophet. Did, did you did you as long you were watching did you see the, the 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 verse where muhammad he saw a dream and he told them i saw in the dream that the enemy the enemy will be few no i don't know i don't know the interpretation i haven't read about it so i can't talk about it right now so why not because I don't know about it. Well, if if he, if if you have I, a prophecy, my friend, if he, if if your prophet is a prophet and he prophesy about Abu Jahl as you claim, right? Then his prophecy should fit everywhere, not only in one case. I can say one thousand lie, one of them come to be true, and then that or not doesn't make me a prophet. It's so, it's so sad that you you know did so much research on Islam, but you can understand Islam. Well, you are the one who understands Islam. Explain to me how Muhammad he say to them, I saw in my dream. That your enemy will be few, and they went to the battle, and they found them that there are a lot. As I so, said, as I said, I haven't done research on this particular verse. It says that in the front of you. It says that that Allah He showed them in the dream that they are few, and go and read the interpretation. They went to the fight, yeah, and they found yeah, that they are yeah, not a few. Because we, because, so, because so who is the one? Who is the one who showed this vision to Muhammad? Allah. Yes, who, Allah says to is Allah. Remember when Allah in in the dream, Allah showed you. So how Allah He show him that they are going to be too many, but uh, the the few. But when they want to fight, they found them too many. Were were Muslims accompanied by angels in their fight? My friend, my friend, who care about who is no? No, they are not. Uh, they, lo they lost. Uh, they lost. My friend, they, they, lost. they lost. They lost. They lost. They lost. My friend, they lost. There is two better. There is Badr Kubra. There is Badr Kubra. There is Badr Sora. Don't play games. Secondly, so, so which, second, which, secondly, which, hold on. Which, let, let me show you. Let me show you. You are the one who said, isn't it the the, the angels uh, fighting with you? Did you say that a second ago? Did you say the angels fighting yeah, with you? This is isn't crying in the battle of Badr. My friend, my, my friend, there is there is two, there is two, there is two battle. Listen, did you say a second ago that the angels fight with you? Yes, in Quran it says that. Okay. That they will come. All right. Angels. So how do you explain to me this uh, this verse in the Quran in the chapter of Al Anfal? Muhammad he told them in chapter eight, verse number sixty-five and sixty-six. So we are Why not jumping. You? We are in the same topic Why about Muhammad being a false prophet. Oh, no, prophet, no, oh, pro ask, hold on, listen, listen, here we go. This is a prophecy. This is a prophecy. Muhammad, he prophesied that 100 of you can fight to uh, 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 1,000 and 200 can fight 2,000. Then the Muslims, they came back and they got busted. So Allah, he said to them, now has Allah lightened your burden for he knew that you have a weakness. So 100 can fight 200. So, so, so if 100 can fight 1,000, to 100 can fight 200 what happened if the angels are fighting with me who care about how many they are look you're talking about okay okay tell me this did a muslim conquer much of the known world my friend is not muhammad who conquer and the muslim they never conquer anything the the the, the, the whole world was collapsing that the, the persian and the and the roman they were fighting each other for the last 300 years and here we go you muslims oh. are conquered yourself all of you are occupied oh. by america the the the, the 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 American colonies all over Saudi Arabia, Qatar, Bahrain, Emirat, you name it, Pakistan, Afghanistan, Iraq, Syria, the American army okay. in every place in the Islamic world in Turkey. So don't tell me now. Let me ask you. Don't change the topic. Here we go. In the lifetime of Muhammad, Muhammad he took his army to fight the Roman. Did he conquer the Roman, or he came back and his ass is red? Okay. No, no, no. He went to a he went to a battle and the enemy ran away. Where, what That's enemy ran away? He, nobody ran away. You are a coward. If they ran away, he would chase them. <laughs> My friend, he went to Tabuk. He went to Tabuk. He did not fight anyone. What are you talking about? It is him who came back. If 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 the enemy ran away, he will continue. Now listen, listen. Explain to me what kind of God he promised you victory. If one hundred can fight 
one one thousand and then right away he says now Allah he knows now he found that you have a weakness Allah do not know yesterday that they have a weakness see I just said you're misquoting things you don't understand the verses okay That's explain to me here we go you are here explain to me go ahead I'm listening Am I am I a scholar you're talking about? So so why you are calling me here we go? He's a scholar. No, so no, so you are misquoting. How you know I am misquoting? How you know is I am misquoting, but you do not know even yourself what the verse means. How you decide in a second that I am misquoting? You are you are you are a genius. You ask me a question. Can I ask you a question too? What you want to ask me now? We we need, we have a problem. We have a problem. Sir, you see how you decide I am misquoting? How you made a decision that I am misquoting? Because you misquoted the first one. You did not and answer about the first one. Here we go. Did you show yes. me a reference? Did you show me a reference? Yes, it's about the Abdullah part. I told you. Where, where? Side. No, you showed me. No, I showed you the reference. You did not show me a reference. I am the one who showed you your scholar saying I this is about Abdullah Hold on. I can show the reference. Stay on the phone. Hmm? Hold on. I can show the reference. Stay on the phone. Go to islamicawareness.org. Islamic and what? You'll see the, you'll see the. Give me the name of the interpretation. Give me the name of the interpretation. What interpretation you want me to go to? Sorry. Give me the name of the interpretation. Which interpretation you like me to go to? Because I'm on the phone, so it's hard for me to go back and forth. Okay, I will give you ten hours to call me back. Go. Who is a Muslim? Abdul, wanna call me? Your prophet is a false prophet, approving left and right. He is a big fat prophet. Fat with lies. I show reference, you don't show nothing. You give me speeches, you call me names. But you cannot prove me wrong. Hmm? The Quran even says that Ibn Abu Sufyan he will go to hell. And let Abu Sufyan later, Muhammad, he paid him 100 camel, him and his family, each one of them 100 camel, and he converted to Islam because this man he liked money. And then Abu Sufyan took over Islam. And the one who conquered other countries, it was not Muhammad, it was Abu Sufyan and his family. A bunch of criminals. Muhammad, he hired them for the perfect job. Muhammad could not fight them. He could not win against them. So he said to himself, okay, let us make a verse for them. He says, al -mu'allafa qulubahum. What is al -mu'allafa qulubahum? Hmm? People who don't believe 